Morning, Bob. Good morning, Bob. 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 Up. Yes, the things we do for your programme. I got up for half past four for you, Jimmy. It's very kind it's very of you both. I, it really is marvellous to see you both looking so well. Quite difficult to open your eyes at this time of the morning, Jim. <laughs> we, we know how you feel. Look, for Alex Ferguson up there in Aberdeen, Alec, uh, you didn't have to go up too early, did you? No, I'm up normal time. Good. Did you, what, 12 o'clock? Yeah. <laughs> now listen, Gre Greaves is going to have a, a little go at you here. Huh? Well, what's that about? How about Jim Layton? Oh, uh, hey! Fergie, what have you done? You've dropped the man of the bat match, the best player you've got, and you've dropped him. Yeah. Now, now what's happened? I think he's something to give me some uh, stick about today. Cool, I bet. I, give well, you I've, heard of some, I've heard of some things, but that's <laughs> untrue. So it's oh, nice no. to see them well lit up there, say, yeah. isn't it? You forgot to put 50p in the media, really, haven't you? Right. Well, we'll get back, back to you all in just a minute. But right. as for the draw itself, much speculation as to how the Mexicans will handle it, particularly after the shambles in Spain the last time. Oh, do you remember this? I, it was incredible. Well, it was horrendous. This was the big, the big will. <laughs> and they were getting out the footballs, weren't they? Trying to go to football. And that one broke in half, if you remember <laughs> rightly. I mean, what a, it was an absolute shambles, isn't it? Dreadful. And uh, the one, that ball there that you just saw was the one that just came out of the ovens. So that was very hot, so that couldn't be handled at the time. And they managed in the end, as you know, to get this ball out. Uh -huh. And this little boy collects it to put it together again, to take over to that man so that he can take it apart again. <laughs> yeah, so don't... it made a lot of sense, didn't it, that? Very right. sensible draw. Well, I think everyone will be hoping that the Mexicans can do better than that tomorrow night, especially with so much at stake. Well, time, I think, to bring in our man in Mexico City, Jeremy Thompson. Of course, it ain't easy being a father. No, it must have been difficult for you, what with all them test tubes and what have you. Oh, yes, I'm not talking about that, Derek. <laughs> I mean, looking after your child's welfare, planning for his future. Have you thought about all that? No, don't you worry about my kid, boys. He'll be all right. And there's a pregnancy itself, Del. That can be hell. Yeah. That can be nine months of pure hell. Yeah, knowing your Mrs. Mike, I can believe it. <laughs> Of course, I was lucky. Marlene gave birth after only eight months. Well, they say it's quicker by tube, don't they? <laughs> uh, anyway, we just come back from Riverside Club. We... Right, that's it. Raquel, get out of the pub, you're barred. What are you talking about, Sid? Hey? Uh, no. Marlene, get out of the pub, you're barred. <laughs> Your pardon. Get off home and take your foster tits with you. <laughs> Did you hear what he just said? <laughs> How dare you? Right, we'll finish our drinks and then you we'll... You will wait. not finish them. You'll get out now. Right. Well, come along, Marlene. I've never been so insulted in my life. Sid, far be it from me to interfere, but I think you're taking this landlord lark a bit too seriously. You're like Mussolini in a local harvester. I'm running this pub now. Well, I don't think you should have banned Boise and Marlene. Oh, yes. And why is that? Because it's their anniversary due. 